What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Platinum Walkthrough, the events, uh, I guess the event series right here. So anywho, in our last episode, we returned to Sinnoh to finish off Pokemon Platinum in all its events because, well, yeah, good old Draven got a little lazy during the pandemic. Who didn't, okay? Give me a break. So in this episode, we're going to be doing the Dark Rite event, and just like always, the code will be on the link or on the description below. I'm going to be pressing these L and R buttons right now, and now we actually have to go into the Pokemon in order to retrieve whatever item that we need to retrieve. So, let's go right here. And there will be an individual waiting for you right here, so let's see. Good day, you must be Draven. I received a gift for you, here you go. We get ourselves a member's card. We look forward to your next visit. So, let's go right ahead and take a look what that member's card is. And as many of you guys already know, yes, I got Pokemon from, uh, or my Pokemon all powered up and all that crud. Who gives a crud, okay? So, let's see. Where, oh, where are, is the member's card right here? So, as you go to the key items, you will be able to find yourself the member's card. A card needed for entering an inn in Candlelave City. Oddly, the last date was marked 50 years ago. Okay, so it looks like to us that we actually have to go straight to Cantilave and take care of business right there. So let's go ahead and use Starblade and uh, go to Cantilave City right here, okay? So there we go, Cantilave City. And, well, another thing too, guys. Let's see. I believe Darkrai will be a roaming Pokemon. I could be wrong. But all you have to do right here is go to this harbor in a roost of restless sailors. Enjoy the sweet dreams in our sumptuous beds. Unfortunately, in a regular game, you won't be able to get into this house. But once you get the member's card, bam, opened up. And there's this individual. He's like, welcome. We've had a reservation for you. We've held it, we've held it a long time. Draven lay down at the bed as if bitten there. Oh, wow. Okay, so, uh, that's scary. Okay, where in the mother loving heck are we? So, as you guys can see, down in the map or wherever the map is being laid, there is a third island that we have just discovered, and now it is time for us to figure out what's over here. I'm hoping candy and probably a rare Pokemon. And as you can see, we are in New Moon Island, and there, right there, is our good old buddy, Darkrai. We haven't seen this guy ever. And, well, before we do anything, yes, let's go ahead and uh, save this game, okay? And yes, I know, I know, I already have 493 Pokemon, but guess what, guys? This is all because I want to show you guys how to do this. Plus, you get the you, you get the code right on the description, okay? For those who are new, cool, cool, fine, fantastic. Okay, so, come on. Okay, I'm pressing that speed button right there. There we go. Okay, maximum effort. Okay, guys, so here it is going up against Darkrai, the legendary Dark type Pokemon. Trust me, this guy is going to be a a very tough one to, to go up against, but I am prepared for him. I am literally prepared for you, Darkrai, so go right ahead. See what you can do. Let's go with a Thunder Wave. As you can see, Darkrai is going to try and put you to sleep because of its effect and its nightmare attack right there. But if you get a paralysis on it and start hitting it with a weaker a weaker attack, you will be able to capture this guy quickly. But again, remember to equip your Pokemon with something that can actually wake it up as soon as possible. Because yes, this Pokemon will try and take advantage of it. Yes, you are paralyzed, you a-hole Pokemon. So here we go. Jock wave for the win. Other thing too, it likes to race his evasiveness and hit you with faint attack because, well, you know... Faint attack right there will actually mess you up, and it will not miss. So here is our opportunity to try and capture this Pokemon. It's as weak as we can get it to. So here we go. Ultra Ball. Come on. Damn it! I hate you, Darkrai. All right, here comes a Hypnosis attack. Yeah, you're you're kind of wasting your attack right there, homeboy. Because yes, I like I said, I have equipped my Gaia with something nice. That's right. We woke up. You won't do nothing now. Okay, so here we go. Let's start throwing up the Ultra Balls. And this Pokemon is not going out without a fight. As you can see, it does like to do a double team. And there's that faint attack. 
if you try to do the same strategy as I tried doing. So, let's go right ahead and see if we can capture it with a timer ball. And this guy right here is not giving an inch, as you can see. Once it gets you in its uh, hypnosis, its bad, its bad dreams effect will start hitting you. And, well, let's go right ahead and go straight to Gaia number four. It's going to take a while for this Pokemon to actually, like, beat me. So, we're going to we're gonna continue throwing these timer balls right here. There we go. Come on! Yes, I know I have Master Balls, but I'm not using them. Not until, well, we get to the ultimate Pokemon right there. So, let's go again. And... Damn it, come on. This Pokemon will not want to be captured. Hurry the hell up, man! God freaking damn it. This Darkrai... Oh my god. I hate you. I, I literally hate you, but it is a very good Pokemon to like at least try and have. So there it is, guys. We caught ourselves Darkrai. Let's get the heck out of here. A voice called out from somewhere. Darkrai, your power is strong. Though you don't will it, you make people and Pokemon around you see terrible nightmares. That is why you came here. New Moon Island, there is no one but you here. There is none that you can be drawn into your nightmare. If anyone were to fall into a nightmare, the Full Moon Island is close by. Huh. And, well, as you can see, we are waking up from this nightmare, as you can see. Holy crud. And the individual... Okay, so we're healed, and the guy has disappeared. And if you go right here, let's see, there's something. Sino now, this is it, you've been waiting for. Sino now, um, yeah, there's really nothing going on right here. So I'm just going to press this right here. Okay, so yeah, that is pretty much it for this little thing. And bam, after we get out, the sailor is going to be like, you've been asleep for a long time, long, long time. Uh, what happened to you? And what were you doing here? No one's lived here for 50 years. That's odd. That is very, very odd. So, let's go right ahead and take a look at the Pokedex entry for Darkrai. And as many of you guys already know, I have trouble just trying to find it. So, let's go ahead and check the Pokedex. Not this guy. We don't have a Bulbasaur right here, but let's go ahead and search for a Pokemon. Let's go for name, D, and... Here we are looking into some pretty good Pokemon, and they are in numerical order, so we're going to have to go all the way down right here. So, let's see, Darkrai, where the heck are you? And we're looking at Pokemon that, you know, like we've seen across the, the, the you know, the whole areas. So, as you can see, here is Darkrai, the pitch black Pokemon. To protect itself, it afflicts those around it with nightmares. However, it means no harm. Yeah. That is, uh, that, that is kind of odd for a sinister looking Pokemon right there. So, anyway, guys, this was the Darkrai event. Yes, we finally got it off. In the next episode, I don't know what event we're going to go be going into, but we'll see what happens. You guys will probably like it or not. I don't know, but I'll see you guys in the next episode as we go into some kind of event. See you guys.